I need a bunch of tops, shirts, blouses, and whatnot. I'm kind of tired of looking like a ragamuffin. I have not bought new clothes in a while. I have like pants and skirts and stuff. I'm going to be going to Kohl's because I think they're going to be the closest to the type of style of stuff I want. And their prices are much higher than what I remember. But luckily, they are good with coupons. I found this 25% off coupon that I am going to take in with me to the store. Okay, it turns out I have a $135 left, so that's going to be my clothing budget. So let's go ahead, go inside Kohl's, and see what I'm able to find. A big thanks to Amber Yu and the rest of my PayPal super thanks and Cash App contributors. I did try to get to Kohl's on a day and time. I didn't think there would be a lot of other people there, but a lot of other folks have the same idea, so, so much for that. Now, I make a note about how much the prices have seemed to go on up in about eight years, but I should have been a little more realistic about that, especially with inflation. Now, it took me a few minutes to find a clearance section. There actually, there was actually quite a large selection. A lot of it was like fall and winter weight, but um, I might need a few of those items too. So let's see what I can find. I end up getting a cart full of items here, a cart full of clothes. So let's go try some stuff on. This is actually a dress. I think it looks good on me. It's a medium, but it's a medium, but it seems like it feels big. All these mediums are a little big on me, but I know I'm a medium, so I don't know what's going on there. definitely going to get this one. I think I'm going to tuck it in and put a sweater around it. I think it fits well. I really want to get this one, but there's threads in the back that are um, like missing, so it's kind of damaged, so it's too bad, but I really wanted that. I decided to go with the next size down in this blouse, and I did that with a couple of the other shirts too. Now it is to the checkout I go. And the good news is, even though my budget was $135, after my 25% off coupon and sales, my total is $94.06. So I'm going to show you what I got next. Hey, everybody. I am back home, and I'm going to show you the articles of clothing that I bought, and I'm going to go over the prices that I paid for each one. Now, in another video, I'm going to tell you sort of like a little bit of a funny story that happened between my husband and I with him waiting on me to buy my clothes, you know, try my clothes on and buy them. And you know how that goes with husbands, so <laughs> that'll be in another video. Okay, so let's start with this cardigan right here. The original original clearance price was $12. The clearance price was, for me was $4 because that one is laying on top. And then the price went down to $2.99 after the coupon so this is actually what i think is the best deal because there's like the most fabric and it's like autumn weight or winter weight 
And here, even though this was cheaper, I didn't think that this was the best deal because it's like a little tank top, right? There's less fabric to it. And it's not really gonna keep you warm or anything, but I love the design on, I don't know if you can see in this light. There's all kinds of like little daisy-like flowers. And this is mint green, and my favorite color is green. Like almost any color, almost any color green I like. So this was originally ten dollars, and marked down to three dollars in clearance. And then I got that for a dollar seventy-nine in the end. So I actually traded these two tops right here, the blue top right here, and this one here for small because the mediums were like slightly large on me. So what happens when you are like kind of hourglass shaped, like if your stomach is like smaller, is that everything will look baggy on you if it's not kind of figure forming. So for a couple of these, I just got ones that were a little slimmer to kind of match my figure a little bit, even though I'm not like skinny or anything. Okay, so the original price for this was $24. Guys, let's face it, these things are t-shirts right here. They're just nice t-shirts. You know, they're, they're just long sleeve t-shirts, like three quarter length. Anyway, the original price on that was $24.99. The sale price was $14.99. And after the 25% off coupon, it was $11.25. Now, I'm happy to pay $11.25 for a long sleeve shirt like that. So I thought that was a really great deal after the coupon. So this, I bought the same shirt over here, right? So that was the same deal originally, 24, and then marked down to 14.99, and then marked down to 11.25. So this might look a little purple or something, but it, it's it's navy blue. I think I look good in navy blue. Now let's go over here. Let's go over here. One of my favorite buys, actually my two favorite buys really are the blouses. They're the blouses. So this is a Nine West shirt. I could swear Nine West was a chain of stores when I was younger. Maybe they still are, I don't know. So, um, so the original price tag is $40. Now on the receipt, the price, the sale price is $36.99, and then that went down to $27.75 after the coupon. I think $27.75 is okay for this shirt because one thing I noticed it has is it has darting right here. So darting is like an extra step that shows that there's um, some shape, some shaping put into the shirt. I think darting is mostly just done for women, I think, for like the chest area, for like helping shape the um, the blouse around the body. So I thought that was a nice, nice deal. And this is the last clearance item I got. It is sort of, uh, I forget what they call this kind of green, but I do like this green. I think it's almost a teal, almost. So this was marked down. Okay, originally $36. It kind of like hurts my heart to think that I, that would be $36. <laughs> I think I'm just kind of one of those people. I'm becoming one of those people who are like, well, when I was younger, sweaters were like $15 and, you know, and now they're like all this money and I'm just thinking everything's expensive. So anyway, the original price on that was $36 marked down to $14.40. 25% off of that was $10.79. So I thought that was a great, a great price. Now the 20% off sale um, price that I saw like for the sign for clearance, I'm not really sure that that came off of these. I think once you have a coupon, that kind of takes over that. I don't think you can stack the coupon and the clearance price. So, okay, and this is my other favorite item right here. This is kind of like a take on a flannel shirt, like the plaid of a flannel shirt, but it's not flannel. This is what I would call kind of like my gardening, one of my gardening shirts where I go out in the garden and I do my work in that, but it's actually kind of, kind of nice. So I'm afraid to do that. So um, this is like mint green, different, different shades of green in here. And this was $36 on the tag. 
and that was after the discount marked down to $22.50 after the sale price and the discount. So yeah, I'm happy with that too. And I had to go go down to a medium for this if I didn't save that already in the video. The one I tried on the dressing room was large. So now guys, I have seven tops that I can wear for a total of $94.06. And you're going to see me wearing these clothes in my videos because, I mean, I like them and I needed some things to wear. So there you go, guys. Um, please tell me in the comments below what is your best deal on any article of clothing that you got. I know a number of you wanted me to go to a thrift shop, but I just, we weren't headed in that direction on the highway so we didn't go to a thrift shop in the future I might do like a, a thrift store haul or something like that but I want to get some new clothes and so anyway I think for $94.06 for seven items at a regular store I think that was I think I got a good deal really especially because of the clearance so okay guys um, I'll talk to you in the comments below have a good day